Okay, on the way. Welcome to this player go test where we're taking a look at Joel Asodro. The 17 year old striker is just a 63 overall. Uh, so highly requested young player here. Uh, some very good stats from the start. Very good dribbler. Uh, probably might even be a better winger, um, you know, than he actually is a striker. You know, especially see it later on with his stats. But he's five foot nine, right footed Mimi and work rates. Three star weak foot, three star skumus. Uh, very high acceleration and sprint speed. Certainly he's going to grow a lot, um, especially without training. But very low attack position. We've seen that before and. For a striker slash attacking player, that could be problematic um, <laughs> to have only 42 attack position at the start. And, you know, without training, he's not going to grow much at all in that stat, unfortunately. And you'll see it, I mean, right away, really. But 77 dribbling is very good. Uh, the short passing is looking solid still. But finishing growth is really awful for strikers. But you can see the finishing is not growing much, but the volleys are growing a lot. So it seems like the just kind of improvement for the shot in general of strikers goes to long shots, volleys. Uh, and you know fin finishing just stays kind of stagnant I mean it's up to 69 now it's it's all right but uh, I was hoping to see you know better growth in that area as up to the 70 overall and now gets up to the 75 overall age 21 so huge growth to the to the acceleration spin speed agility looking decent along with balance but 88 dribbling 84 short passing and only 74 finishing so I mean his finishing is pretty subpar he's definitely better off as a winger um, so I probably would play him there in all honesty um, if you're gonna be not using training but of course with training you're gonna be able to you know work that finishing uh and all that so uh some very good highlights from him though with the passing the passing what you know ended up capping out you know being very good um yeah, as you can see him continue to push forward it's very good in the, in the build up play plays a nice pass here through and continues to be a, kind of just gonna a good playmaker for me i definitely played him as a cam uh, as well as a winger and not as just as a striker i uh, was very effective there especially with how he grew without the training and all that but but uh, was able to manage to score a few goals here and there, but had mostly assist this and assists. Oh, assist is what the hell is that assist and created a lot of chances for me with that passing ability and of course his dribbling and all that but uh again scored a couple of goals but just wasn't you know super you know efficient in front of goal because it's finishing i mean it's decent it's above average but it's nothing really other than that it's not very good uh or great but uh he still can score you know some goals from time to time get behind that defense with his acceleration sprint speed as you can see in this highlight and grab himself a goal but uh we'll take a look at him now capped out this 80 overall age 25 only 45 attack position again but maxed out acceleration and spin speed 85 balance 77 agility 99 dribbling 97 short passing 76 finishing so he is absolutely ridiculous in those areas and then also has 99 volleys uh he's a speedster and dribbler specialties um so i think you know it's one of those cases where you're gonna probably train him um so he's gonna look a lot different because you're obviously gonna want to train that strike that finishing uh so he's a much better striker so i didn't feel like showing the calculation to that because I'm sure um, I, I I mean I recommend you, you train that finishing because I mean he capped out with the volleys again uh, capped out with the dribbling at the 99 but uh, I think you guys you know if you're playing a longer career mode even um, you, you're gonna want to train him to get that finishing up so it's not all allocated to the dribbling volleys passing uh, as well as the acceleration spin speed and of course the lack of attack position growth is a bit weird but I think this video is actually a good way to showcase how screwed up really some of the growth is in this game but uh, either way um, he turns into a much better cam or winger uh, and he's just kind of an average striker due to the lack of finishing ability um, yeah so with that guys thanks for tuning in I'll be signing out now and I'll catch you guys later